The Connection Machine System is a data parallel computer. It utilizes 64,000 processors which are configured to match the data structures of specific applications. Applications areas include image processing, document retrieval, seismic processing, circuit optimization, circuit simulation, and fluid dynamics. The connection machine system is ideal for image processing. The analysis of aerial images is one such application. Here, two cameras are pointed down at a model terrain. Because the cameras are at different positions, each sees the scene from a slightly different angle. Elements of the scene that are above ground level jump noticeably between the two views. Elements that are low to the ground appear in the same position in each image. Connection machine stereo matching algorithms use this parallax phenomenon to compute the contours of the scene. Left and right images are brought into the system. Each image has 64K pixels. Each pixel is assigned to a separate processor. In a single computer operation, all the distortion in the images is removed. Next, the information in the images is compressed by keeping only the edges, the places in the image which go sharply from light to dark or dark to light. In the key step, the compressed images are shifted over each other. During this shift, areas where the terrain is high will align first. The lowest level areas will align last because they jump the least from left view to right view. The height of every edge section of the overall scene is computed from the alignment information gathered in the previous step. Here, the highest edges are shown in the lightest tones. The lowest areas are dark. Next, the height information is filled in for all the areas between the edges. And a contour map is computed. Processing requires 500 million computer operations and runs in half a second. Scientists are using the connection machine system to pioneer new approaches to fluid dynamic simulation. Previous methods have been based on partial differential equations. The connection machine approach models packets of particles directly. Operation of the system is straightforward. The flow of fluid can be started and stopped interactively. The density of the fluid can be adjusted up or down, as can the velocity. Several different flow parameters may be observed. Setup is straightforward. The user simply places an object into the fluid field and starts the simulation. At the beginning of the run, we see two vortices form behind the plate. In the color version of the output, the initial shock wave is clearly visible. The unsettled area behind the flat plate stretches out until it finally becomes unstable and breaks away. As the simulation proceeds, the whole complex behavior of fluids emerges. Vortices shed alternately from the top and bottom edges of the plate. Production of this 30-second sequence required 15 minutes of connection machine time. The results obtained by simulation match the behavior observed in real-world fluids. It is also easy to create new objects. Once created, objects may be placed in the fluid field and meaningful results obtained in a minute or so. The connection machine system updates 750 million sites per second. These six applications are suggestive of the many types of problems that connection machine systems solve. Applications cover the spectrum from words to pictures to numbers and from commercial database to scientific problem solving. They also illustrate the ease with which the connection machine system is programmed. Each of these applications required less than a person year to implement. <laughs>